On one of Taiwan's outlying islands, just 20 kilometers from China, lies a most unconventional spot. It sits in a former military stronghold, but now offers fortification of a different kind. And it's not the only stronghold that's been repurposed. These military structures were built after Chinese nationalist leader Chiang Kai-shek and his troops fled China for Taiwan in 1949, after losing a civil war. Taiwan became the new base for their Republic of China government, which is still Taiwan's official name. Matsu has about 250 strongholds, a reminder of how these small islands used to very much be on the front lines of conflict between Taiwan and China. But today, some of them have been turned into tourist attractions, including a guest house, museum, and like this one, an art space. Where Chinese communist forces used to shell, art now stands as a testament to the changing face of Matsu. And underneath Sao's coffee shop, another wartime space converted for reflection. To symbolize the literary work, War and Peace, a juxtaposition not lost on the coffee shop's customers who enjoy exploring above and below ground. While these islands are no longer under attack or martial law, there is still an army presence here, a sign of remaining tensions between Taiwan and China. This repurposed stronghold is a reminder of its wartime history, while those who visit hope conflict remains a thing of the past. Damon Lin and Louise Watt for Taiwan Plus.